is a video on ploughing. Can you plough in the furrow with GPS? Well, you can, as long as you get the furrow width right. I've got it set at, we have to see all this, uh, toolbox. 2.75 metres wide on a six fur Vernon plough, which is just over 18 inches of fur. And, and the GPS is working. Sometimes it struggles a little bit. I mean, at the moment we are running, I'll keep it still enough, two, four, two centimetres off line, so it's driving perfectly at the moment. But it suits this field really well because I don't know if you can see from this video but the, every row gets longer and if you don't have something like this you soon end up with a, a either a turn to the left or a turn to the right on the end of the furrow but no that seems to be working seems to be working really well they just have to get the the working width right so we've almost finished this uh, small field about four acres hectares nine nine and a bit acres of it on this field but it's a very funny very funny shaped field you've got a small bit in this corner here and then over here looks other the trees you've got another small bit we seem, we seem to be getting there almost finished plan for another season 2018 it's september the 21st today i think let's have a look yeah, run uh, one no, it's September the 20th today, September the 20th. So yeah, we've got this field, another about 20 acres of the rest of sugar beet, so yeah. Yep, so when you get to the end, what you have to do is just plough out and see this row's getting longer than the previous one. The GPS will just guide me straight out till I need to lift the plough out. Lift the plough out, cancel the cruise, turn the steering, that'll cancel the GPS, press this button here which will narrow the plow and turn him over. Then it's in the cycle of a turnover and then you should see this little round here put it back out to the 18 inches exactly where it was, that's preset. Then you just go forwards here. You can see on the screen wait till it hits the right red line, the one next to it, and you press the engage the steering and then the steering will just take over and then normally when I'm less than about 10 centimeters in the right position I drop the plow and then away we go and you can see it's now going to drop nicely in the bottom of the furrow there just press the C button and away we go that's another nice straight row of plow in here Anyway guys, this is another update for me, I haven't done many videos lately, I've been too busy, but just thought I'd get another one out, hopefully pretty soon, hopefully there will be many days before this video comes out. So yeah, cheers guys, bye bye.